Good morning, Rich Point Church. You guys may be wondering why I'm standing outside in the front of my house today. Well, it was two years ago in 2006 of August that we began to meet here for the very first time as a church. We began to meet as a small group. And so what I want to do today is invite you into my house and uh, kind of see what was going on back there in 2006. So won't you guys come and join me? I'm glad you guys could make it here. Uh, where you guys are at right now is the downstairs area of our house. And uh, this is actually the place where our kids met for that very first night as uh, we were having that small group gathering. And I remember the kids were just kind of running around and jumping and uh, just excited to be around each other. And uh, don't know if they really knew what was taking place, but I, I just know that there was an excitement down here in this room. Kind of got a little bit rowdy at times, but... Uh, uh, it was just really, really neat to see all the kids here together and, and just the anticipation of what God's going to do. Uh, so, you guys come on with me. We're going to go upstairs here and I'm going to show you where us adults met for the very first time. So, come on. Come on. It's okay. Wow, you guys are fast. I'm glad you guys made it. Uh, where you're at right now is in my living room. And right here is the very first place that we began to meet as Ridge Point Church and uh, there were just a few of us uh, in the room but I remember it was jam-packed with excitement and anticipation about what was taking place and just a sense of the unknown of what God was about to do and we didn't know how everything was going to be done we didn't know where we were going to be going or where we were going to be meeting but we knew that God had called us together at, at this point in time at this place and uh, began to share from Acts chapter 2 and shared the vision and asked the question, what could God do in the life of a group of people who absolutely sowed out to his call and to his ministry to be a light in this community? And uh, it's been pretty amazing to see what God's done in the last year and a half. And uh, just so excited to be a part and be the pastor at Ridge Point Church. So this is where we started out from. Um, kind of gives you a little background and history of where we began. And it was an exciting time then. But God's done some exciting things uh, since then. And so let's go, and we're going to take a little journey. We're going to take a trip, and uh, I want to show you where we've been for the last year and a half. So come on and follow me. guys, uh, where we're at right now is we're at the Y, of course, and uh, you guys are well familiar uh, with this place. It's where we've been for the last year and a half. And so I want you guys to come follow me and see where we've been meeting here in uh, the meeting room, sanctuary, if you will, worship area, and uh, just talk a little bit about what God's done the last year and a half. So come on. Well, as you guys can see, this is uh, the Y meeting room where we've been meeting for the last year and a half. And uh, I remember the very first time that uh, we were here on that first Sunday of uh, January 07 and just uh, the excitement that was here uh, in this room. And uh, it was kind of a little bit crazy that morning. People were kind of running around everywhere. I know I was running around, uh, didn't know where things were going to be set up and kind of stuff like that. But... Uh, God had his hand definitely upon that service. In the very first service that we had, we had 75 people, and three people gave their heart to Christ. And it was just affirmation for us as a church uh, that God's hand was upon us, and this was just the very first of uh, the more good things to come. And uh, over the last year and a half, as we've been right here at the YWCA, God has sent people from all walks of life. Uh, we've had an opportunity to minister to all kinds of people in this community. And do a lot of great things. Uh, we've had almost 50 people come to know Christ in the last year and a half. And it's not anything that we've done, but it's just a show of God's good hand that's been upon us. And so we're very, very excited uh, about what God has done here in the last year and a half. But let's be reminded that there's more 
things to come. And God has some good things in store for us. So now we've got to look at where we started. We're looking currently right now of where we're at. And this is the last day that we're here at the Y. It's a time of celebration. It's, a, it's an ending, but it's also a, a new beginning for us to head. And so what I want to do right now is want you to come follow me one more place. Because uh, we're going to look at where we're headed. So I want you guys come and just follow me. Come on. Welcome to the movies, Ridge Point. We're here at Tinseltown Theater in Oak Ridge at our new location of where we're going to be meeting starting next week. And I don't know about you, but just me standing here right now gives me chill bumps, and I'm just so excited about what God is about to do in the life of this church. Man, we have a great opportunity to see God do some amazing things. So I pray that as we come next week, that we would come with an anticipation, we'd come with an excitement, and that we would come with an expectation that God is going to move in such a way unlike we've never seen before. And just think, next Sunday morning when we see all the people who are going to be walking through those doors, what a great opportunity we have to reach people for the Lord Jesus Christ. So this week, here's what we need to do. We need to share, we need to tell, we need to hand out the tickets that we're going to give, and man, just tell people about what God's doing in the life at Ridgepoint Church. And so I hope you join me. Hope you're going to be here next week and hope you're going to bring somebody with you. Let's come and let's get ready to worship and lift up the name of Jesus for His glory. See you guys next week. Thank you.